Uga chaga, uga chaga, uga uga, uga chaga, uga chaga. Uh, <coughs> What's up, sons? It's Blind Rod with Son of a Tech once again, and today we have yet another how to video. These are quite honestly my favorite videos, and today we're going to be showing you guys how to get three quarter or 75% of the mining speed from the RTX 3060 in Hive OS. But before we get into it, here's a word from our sponsor. Today's sponsor is myself. To support the channel, click the join button down below and you will be able to access our privately hosted rocket chat. Selecting the 199 option will get you access and after that you just need to head on over to the membership tab, scroll down and expand out your membership perks and find the section for connecting on social media. In that section there will be a secret registration URL for rocket chat where you can sign up and enjoy talking with other cryptocurrency enthusiasts and miners without scammers, spammers or bots. Mm -hmm. We're looking for more sponsors, but they've been a little sketch lately. Alrighty, so what I'm going to show you guys here is we are a little late, so we are looking at an update that was on the 15th of May for Hive OS on version 0.6-203 at 210515 for Linux. This specifically pertains to the version of LOL Miner, which is version 1.29, which added the NVIDIA 3060 Unlocker for Linux for using with NVIDIA drivers from version 455.45.01 and up to version 460.39. So this new mode, allows to mine at speed about three quarter of maximum speed of this card, allows use of risers and allows multiple GPUs in one system. So if you have a 3060 and you're wanting to get it into HiveOS and get it into the farm, you're definitely gonna to wanna to be looking at this version of HiveOS and then make sure that your NVIDIA drivers are correct. So if we go ahead and hop on over to my Hive, you can see we're actually mining currently. We have an RTX 3080 and an RTX 3060 in this current system. It is on LOL Miner and it is already updated to the latest OS version here. The problem we have now is that the NVIDIA driver version is too new. As you can see, it's 460.67. So we need to roll that back and that's kind of the process we're gonna go over here with you guys. First things first, to just make sure this goes through smoothly is that we're going to go into settings and we are going to basically enter maintenance mode and we are going to do it with loading drivers and wait for the system to apply and then we will reboot the system here. The config is changing. Okay, and now that it's applied, we're gonna go ahead and reboot the system. Okie dokie, now that the miner has rebooted and it's back up, we just need to go ahead and get the hive shell started. So we're just gonna highlight the rig and then we're gonna go up and click remote access. And then we're gonna click hive shell start. And then we are gonna wait until the hive shell is started. Now that the hive shell is started, we're just gonna click it and then click the link and it will open up the hive shell and really at this point what we are looking to do is go ahead and update the nvidia driver so you can see here there's the nvidia dash driver dash update you'll need to specify the exact driver version that is compatible with lol miner unlocker for the nvidia rtx 3060 so we're going to do nvidia dash driver dash update and then space and then we're going to put the version number the latest version number is going to be 460.39 and then we're going to go ahead and hit enter at this point it will show the installed version is 460.67 and then it will begin to download the .39 version and run that and then once it's updated, we will exit, of course, maintenance mode and verify that it is functioning correctly. Okie doke, so now that the driver installation is successful, we should be able to continue on. We're gonna go back to the dashboard for Hive OS. We're gonna click in and we're gonna go back over to settings. And then we are going to scroll down and exit maintenance mode by selecting disable and then let the worker update. 
Now, in some cases, you might need to reboot the worker. I've had that happen, of course. And then in some cases, you don't need to. It's really just going to be dependent on what happens with your rig. But at this point, you can see here that we have NVIDIA driver version 460.39. So at this point, we're just going to wait for the miner to begin working. And then we will go ahead and verify. Okie doke. So there it is. As you guys can see, we're at 32.8 mega hash a second on the RTX 3060. Let's go back to the dashboard and verify over here. It's still building up, so we'll give it a little bit of time. But as you can see in the miner here, we're just going... Okay, there it is. Yeah, so as you can see in the miner here, it is working itself up. We're at 37.29 mega hash a second. Let's go ahead and take a look over here at what it's showing. Alrighty, so in Hive OS we have it showing at 33.23 mega hash a second. And then in the miner we're showing about 37 mega hash a second. I'll have to do some more research, see what our absolute core clocks will be, and we'll get back to you guys with overclocking at a later date. Boom! Alright, so there you go fellas. There is how to get the RTX 3060 mining at 75% of its hash rate in Hive OS. Once again, just to overview that, you're going to need to update your Hive OS to the latest version. And then after that, you will need to make sure that the driver is on the correct version or a supported version, with the latest being 460.39. So if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section below, and I will see you next Tuesday. If you enjoyed this content, you can check out more crypto content on this playlist up here, or of course, go ahead and subscribe for more in the future. Adios.